Hey folks, welcome back to the Cotswold Collectibles YouTube channel. I am Greg Brown, president and owner of Cotswold Collectibles. This week we wanted to dive back in to one of our more popular lines, which is World Peacekeepers from MNC Toy Center. And in particular this week, we wanted to talk about the Watchtower set. What we're gonna talk about today is what all comes with the set, all the features and benefits that come with the set and how this set can actually uh, cross over into other collecting genres, in particular Adventure Team slash Explorers um, slash 1964 to 69 G.I. Joe. So what we're going to do first is we're going to talk about all the accessories that come with this set. So I have some of these. I have pretty much all the accessories laid out here in, for, in front of you. Um, one of the coolest pieces or one of the cooler pieces that comes with this set is the crate. And I recently discovered that the crate actually does open up and you can put stuff into it or just leave it closed like that. Great little piece. Um, you also have this uh, missile system. Uh, it actually does come with the little rockets that you can shoot out, but I don't know, I'm 50 years old. I really don't dig that anymore, but it's a really nice piece. It's a very large piece. Um, so for like a uh, anti, anti-personnel or to the anti-tank, anti-airplane, whatever you want it to be. Great piece, good and solid. <clears throat> Next is the M60 uh, machine gun. It comes with a bipod. It also comes with an ammo belt and it also comes with a uh, ammo box. So you have that as another weapon. The third weapon that comes with the set is the M4 carbine. Um, this particular set comes with an M4 carbine that actually has uh, two magazines and the coupler and then I think it has a little scope on top. Unfortunately, I don't have those with me at the moment for, uh, at the time of this video. Um, other weapons include a 45 with a tack light on it, um, as well as a knife and sheath. Then you have two smoke grenades. Then you have two ammo pouches. So you have the old school style ammo pouches that you can fit the grenades into. And these are the grenades that go with them. Well, grenades and they fit in there just perfectly. And like I said, there's two of these pouches. So here's the other pouch with the grenades already in them. So you can kind of see what they look like. Then you have your binoculars. Of course, you need your sunglasses. Then you have your communication through radio with your handset and your whip antenna. And then finally, you get down to your figure. Now the figure comes with a mohawk, which I don't understand why he came with a mohawk, but he did. But the great thing about it is that he comes with a helmet that can cover up that mohawk. Uh, he is outfitted in the woodland pattern camouflage. Uh, he has his BDU jacket, pants, helmet with cover. He also has his web belt, his uh, pistol holster, drop down pistol holster that'll hold that 45, as well as his boots. And he comes with gloved hands as well and black boots. But enough talking about all these accessories. Let's talk about the big thing this right here is what makes this set so fantastic. This is the watch tower. And as you can see, it is huge. Um, the packaging, the box that it comes in, it actually makes it look, look smaller, but the way that they package this and pack it, it packs it into a pretty considerably smaller box. And so the shipping isn't as bad as you would think. Um, but the panels all put together, these come into four pieces and such. I went ahead and I put four figures in this from a previous video to demonstrate how many figures can actually fit in here. I put four, you can actually put five, but um, you can kind of get the idea. I was going with an adventure team theme with this because I'm a super big adventure team fan. But what you get with this set, with this particular piece is amazing. You get a 50 caliber machine gun on the front. Then if you rotate it here, You get a rope and pulley system here um, to haul up gear. It also comes with, it's really nice and it's, it's a rubbery type of material netting. So you could put gear into here and then you can just basically pull it up with, with the winch. Then what you do is on this side, you flip it over here and you have a floodlight. It is a non-functioning floodlight, but it does look like it does, it does look like it works, but it really doesn't. And then finally, you turn it to the back and you have the rope ladder system where the figure can get up there. So, and this can come off if you wanted to build your own wooden one, you can. 
um, but I just like the way it came. I've seen some people take this and they'll paint it Adventure Team yellow, but some people have painted it black, some people leave it just the way it is, which is the way that I like it. Um, but considering the price, and the price is amazing on this set, it's only $79.99. And you get the tower, you get the figure, you get all the equipment. But like I said, the creme de la creme is, is this tower. Um, this used to be in the market years ago. It kind of disappeared off the market. I see people say, hey, I just found this, da da da, -da um, at a junk sale or a yard sale, but we still have them. We've already sold through our first batch of them. And this is our second batch of them. But if you're an adventure team collector, um, if you're a military 1960s G.I. Joe collector, or if you just like to have a watchtower in your, your man cave or in your collection, this is the must have for you. Because I mean, this if this doesn't pay homage to the Adventure Team Training Center, I don't know what does. But we still got them in stock. Check them out online. Uh, we'll post the item code for it. But uh, you need to get one. It's an awesome piece. This one is going to be going to my house. So, But anyway, that's our short video for this week. Um, Next week, we're probably going to take a look at a few other World Peacekeeper sets um, because they've been doing really, 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 really good here. And until then, uh, make sure that you uh, like and subscribe to our page and leave any comments about this particular video. Until then, see you next week. Thanks.